Always incorporate a dynamic warm-up at the start of your session. Don't just think of it as a way to reduce injury, but actually treat it as a part of your sessions and you're going to get tons more out of your drills. Then I always go into a little bit of activation just using this resistance band. I go through each of these movements around 10 repetitions or so, making sure everything is activated and ready to go, especially those hard to activate areas like the groins and glutes and hip flexors. These are really going to help you fire those up again, just like with the dynamic warm up, it's going to help you perform better and also reduce the risk of injury.